What's up guys, this is Josh with Live Love Music at the Orange Amplification booth. Um, and we have Doug here who's gonna show us the new amp, uh, the OPC. So here we go, Doug, go for it. Hi Josh, how you doing? Good. Excellent, so what we've got here is the OPC. It's basically the first PC designed for recording creative musicians. From the ground up, there's all sorts of great I.O. One of the things I think a lot of musicians commonly face a challenge of is that they've got a home recording setup. They're constantly trying to get to wherever they got to plug stuff. So all the I.O. that you're going to mainly need, two quarter inch inputs and a USB input are on the top so you can get to it easily. It's portable and really kind of what it does really well is it's kind of halfway in between a laptop and a tower. Laptop, you have limited I.O. Monitoring is usually kind of a nightmare. Uh, a, a tower, you can upgrade, you can do all sorts of great stuff, but you can't really take it with you. This guy's got two uh, JBL 6.5 inch speakers. It's in stereo. It's got 5.1, 7.1 outputs, HDMI out. It's got all the best computer features that you could want to have in terms of I.O., but yet it's specifically designed for musicians. It's got extra low latency. Again, one of the things about latency is there'll be times that even with lower latency, you may not always hear it, but as you're playing as a musician, you feel it. And there are things that are just happening organically as you're playing that if it doesn't feel good, you're not going to have a good experience. So definitely don't want latency. Definitely don't want latency. <laughs> latency is a bad word. So uh, the OBC comes with a number of great premium software packages, full versions, not trialware. It comes with Amplitude 3.0 as well as uh, some custom orange models that are in that. It's got Easy Drummer Lite, which is a phenomenal application. If you haven't used Easy Drummer, you got to check it out. Uh, it comes with Studio One, it comes with Mixcraft, and it also comes with a very cool thing called Lick Library so you can get your lessons on. And there's, there's all sorts of stuff there that you know, whether you're just wanting to delve into the creative process and, and, and document what you're doing, really kind of the way I work, I, I get inspired by sounds. So what I do is I go in and do a little bit of sound design, pull up some loops and start playing, which for me is really kind of that opens the door and it's done that so incredibly well.